Certain procedures will require the air seal access port to be placed first prior to insufflation, either optically guided or using the Hassan open cut down technique. Gain initial access to the abdominal cavity. Ensure the distal tip of the cannula is inserted beyond the black line on the cannula. Disconnect the single lumen adapter and set it aside. Remove the manifold plug from the bullseye manifold on the air seal access port. Connect the now exposed tri lumen tubing connector to air seal's bullseye manifold by turning the tube set's locking ring clockwise until it's tight. Set the desired flow rate and pressure value. Press Start on the IFS screen. It's ideal to leave the obturator in place during initial insufflation, but not required. Wait until proper abdominal pressure is achieved, remove the obturator when prompted, and wait for the 8 to 15 second calibration cycle to complete prior to inserting any instruments or scope through the air seal port or inserting any additional trocars into the abdomen. Once complete, an audible tone will sound, alerting the user that air seal mode is active and ready for use, and a green bar will appear on the IFS screen showing air seal active. Once air seal mode is active, the flow rate is set to auto flow control and the smoke evacuation can be set to either low at 3 liters per minute or high at 8 liters per minute. At the end of the procedure, press stop. Air seal mode needs to complete a calibration prior to shutdown. Follow the screen prompts and wait for final calibration to complete prior to disconnecting the filtered tube set from the IFS unit and powering off the IFS unit. Please proceed to the next module for more information.